The Space Shuttle Endeavour touched down at the Kennedy Space Center on 1st of June and in the shuttle's 19-year flying career. The Endeavour crew completed four spacewalks and several maintenance upgrades on the International Space Station. Those were part of the shuttle's final mission. Among the crew were two Air Force astronauts, mission pilot Colonel Gregory Johnson and mission specialist Colonel Mike Fink. Both were thrilled to be part of the shuttle's final mission. Astronomers across the country have been observing a very special phenomena. It only happens every two decades. It's the supermoon. Now the supermoon is not just a full moon. It is when our satellite, the moon, is in its closest, closest distance to Earth. Now some people believe that the full moon, not to mention the supermoon, have some strange, strange effect on our behavior. Some people blame it on crimes and some people even blame the Japanese tsunami on it. Now let's try to find out what people think about it. It doesn't seem to affect people's behavior. I really don't think it does. But um, maybe I'm the exception, I'm not sure. So it didn't affect you at all? It didn't affect us at all, we just loved it. We you just love loved it. watching it. Brilliant. It should have effect on people's behavior. Do you notice anything different or do you believe in that? Um, I guess, yeah, I think I do. I mean, everything has effect on you, doesn't it? So I suppose if the moon uh, is a lot bigger and a lot closer, I suppose it would affect, affect your mood, affect your, the way you react to things. The 100th anniversary of the sinking of the Titanic is to be marked with a cruise that will follow the ship's original route. Bookings for the historic cruise open today, exactly 97 years after the Titanic was lost, with the departure date set for early April 2012. With the heat wave predicted for this summer, and with the economic crisis still hitting most of us, many British families prefer to stay home for the summer holiday. Now, in this lovely Buckinghamshire town, I'm going to find out what summer plans most people have. Are they going to stay home in the UK or are they going abroad? Let's find out. The start of summer is officially underway and it's going to be hot with temperatures rocketing to 30 degrees Celsius by Saturday. Seems like most people prefer to stay home in this glorious weather. Now I'm off for a barbecue. From me Adeline, join me next time.